When you pray for someone, you are offering them the most purest kind of love. Greetings in the matchless name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Luke chapter 6 verses 27 and 28 says, But to you who are listening, I say, Love your enemies, do good to those who hate you, bless those who curse you, pray for those who mistreat you. Have you ever wondered why God asks us to pray for those who mistreat us? We all know that Jesus died for us on the cross while we were still sinners. Even when we were still hurting him, he forgave us out of the purest of love he had for us. In the same way, he also asks us to pray for the people who mistreat us. Any person will get angry when they are mistreated. We pray for the people who love us, we pray for the people whom we love automatically. But we sometimes don't even think something good should happen to the people who mistreat us. We might even curse them in the worst case. But Jesus asks us to pray for them because even in this he is teaching us to love people no matter how they treat us. He is teaching us to be like Him, just like how He forgave us while we were persecuting Him and doing things that does not please Him. Anyone can simply say that they forgave the person who did something bad against them. But true forgiveness comes only through prayer. Only when we start praying for them, we will be able to forgive them wholeheartedly and the love of Jesus will be displayed through us. Let us pray. Loving Heavenly Father, help us Lord Jesus to love the people who hate us. Help us to pray for the people who mistreat us. Father Jesus, turn our hearts like your heart Lord Jesus. Father God, as humans, we immediately get angry and we immediately show such kind of contempt against the people who do something wrong against us. But Father Jesus, just like how you forgave us on the cross, give us also that willing heart to forgive the people who mistreat us. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Have a blessed day. God bless you.